Item number, SCP-646. Object class, Euclid. Special containment procedures. SCP-646 is kept in Customized Containment Unit 9277 in Biosite 66. The floor is to be rinsed daily, and drain grates are to be checked weekly for buildup. Personnel are to wash SCP-646 once every two weeks, with warm water and gentle scrubbing tools. Basic low-hazard decontamination showers are to be performed by personnel after this wash. Subject does not seem to require sustenance. A daily serving of 10 kilograms high-quality edible material is allotted to promote relative activity. All species of offspring are to be examined and logged. If any presiding researchers identify offspring they deem worthy of further research, personnel are to follow appropriate protocols. All unwanted offspring are to be immediately destroyed. Description SCP-646 is a large, translucent gray, bloated creature, measuring roughly 5.6 meters in length, weighing between 3,400 and 3,700 kilograms. At one end of its body is the approximation of a torso, with a prominent ribcage and a wide, round head. Seven sets of three jointed limbs are located evenly spaced down the front of the body. A long series of udder-like organs are located between these limbs. The body tapers to a blunt point with a cloaca-like orifice, the entire frame heaving and shuddering irregularly. The shadows of various internal organs, lungs, hearts, and a digestive tract can be seen through SCP-646's flesh. The flesh is quite smooth and malleable, and a clear, harmless mucus constantly oozes from its skin. SCP-646 is constantly producing unrelated infant organisms. For the purposes of this document, SCP-646 is in a state of giving birth. When one infant creature has been born, another will appear within SCP-646, and the birthing process will begin again. Births do not seem to cause it any discomfort, and all offspring are completely unremarkable, apart from their anomalous origin. Interestingly, oviparous animals, such as birds and fish, are born whole, outside of an egg. There is no logical order behind what species of animal will be born next. It seems that absolutely any multicellular animal that has ever existed on Earth can be birthed by SCP-646. It is unknown how SCP-646 is producing these infants at this time as there is no gestation period between births. The current intake of material by SCP-646 cannot account for the mass of the infant animals, or its constant slime discharge. Research is pending. SCP-646 shows no signs of sapience, and is mostly docile, unless actively provoked. Lesson complete. If you missed the previous orientation, go watch SCP-645. Mouth of Truth, right now, or for the complete course, watch this playlist.